Hey guys, welcome back to Enchanted by You. This is Cassandra. I'm so excited that you're here. I hope everyone's having a great holiday season. Wanted to do something kind of fun for the holidays and I came up with probably the craziest idea and it's gonna seem really strange, but bear with me because I, I think it would be a lot of fun. So let's just see. Everyone I know is getting ready for Santa Claus and is Santa coming to your house? Have you been good or have you been naughty? Hopefully Santa will show up and worst case scenario, if you've been a little naughty this year, maybe you'll get a lump of coal in your stocking. But in a lot of parts of the world, they actually believe, and you might have seen the movie about this guy, they believe in a demon-like creature called Krampus. And he's got Hoven hoofs and huge goat horns and a spiked tongue and a tail and he's really creepy. Now it is said that Krampus goes back to the old pagans and the old witchcraft and is actually an old deity. And I don't know if you know much about Krampus, but basically if you have been naughty, instead of getting just nice coal in your stocking, after this you're going to want coal, trust me. but. Krampus carries around chains and bales, bells, and he's really creepy and really scary. And he also carries a stick or a whip to whip the children that have been naughty. Now, if you've been extremely naughty, say you've been a really, really, really bad kid, like the worst, Krampus also has a bag. And it is said that he scoops up the kids and puts them in his bag and either takes them back to his den and eats them, or I guess if they're horrible, horrible kids, then he drags them down to hell. So, pretty creepy guy. Now, I do paranormal stuff and I talk to spirits. So, what in the world does a Krampus, you know, have to do with anything that I typically do? Well, that's kind of where the fun part comes in. So, I hope you guys bear with me, but here's what I'm thinking. This is, he is supposed to be part of, you know, the old pagan traditions and he's supposed to be this evil ancient deity and I want to ask the spirits is he real is he a demon does he go by a different name now does he still visit naughty children why don't we why do we not hear about him so let's go ahead and why don't we ask the spirits and see now I'm not inviting him over to my house so don't be like I'm gonna be talking to Krampus or anything like that I have no problem inviting most spirits over to my house but just in case Krampus is real, we're not going to do that because I have kids, they're pretty good kids, but just in case they made maybe a little bit of mistakes this year, I don't want to see my kids whipped or, you know, carried off in a bag to hell or anything like that. So I'm not inviting Krampus over, but we will talk to the guides and see what they have to say about Krampus and go from there. So hopefully this will be kind of fun, kind of spooky, and maybe we can see how you can avoid him for Christmas and so maybe a little even educational. We don't know. Uh, let's go ahead and get to the spirit box. My spirit boxes are 100% real, 100% raw, 100% noise, very loud. So be careful. I don't edit the noise. I don't edit my spirit boxes because I want you guys to see it as pure as I'm, I see it. And my spirit boxes are also reviewed by a military specialist. So anything he sees, anything I see, not see, but anything either one of us here, will be throughout the video. If you hear something different, leave it in the comments below. I would love to hear from you guys. And let's get to the spirit box and see what we can find out about this Krampus character. Hello, Ethan and me, are you there? Let's stop moving. Ethan and E, when you are there, can you please come through really loud and let us know that you're here with us? I don't want you to go get someone, but I want to talk to you about something. Yes, have you guys heard of the Krampus? What do you think of Krampus? I wanted to ask you guys for Christmas. Jeez, that's loud. I wanted to ask you guys for Christmas. Is Krampus real? Let's see if I can turn this down a little bit. There, it's getting really loud. So is Krampus? 
Elvis real. Is Krampus a demon? Is, Kramp if Krampus is a demon, um, does he go by a different name? If he goes by a different name, can you tell me the name of the demon that he goes by now? Like, what is his new name? Because we don't hear much about him anymore, so does he go by a different name? Does Krampus still harm children? Okay, this is going to sound really kind of crazy, but just in case we have any viewers out there who have been extremely naughty, and I know we don't, but just in case... How can one, how can you protect yourself against Krampus? And I have one last question. What does he do with the very bad children? Okay, let's switch spirit boxes real quick. Okay, let's switch spirit boxes real quick. And see if we can maybe get some better answers. I'll be right back. Okay, guys, if you are new here, then I will fill you in on what we are doing. I like to use two spirit boxes. Um, the first one that you saw I was using was the PSB 7 spirit box. Second one I use is actually an app uh, for iOS. It's called SBX12 spirit box, and I use the light version, so it doesn't cost anything, and I've never had any problems with it. It's actually pretty amazing, and I've gotten some great answers. Um, where one will say one answer and then the other one will say the exact same answer But sometimes I can get better sentences out of this one. So let's go ahead and ask our questions on the app Hello, Ethan and E, are you there? My light is super moving Oh, oh, oh Sorry, guys. I had to move my camera. Are you guys moving my light? Okay, I'm going to ask you some of the same questions. Is Krampus really a demon? If Krampus is a demon, does he go by a different name nowadays? Does he still harm children? What does he do with the very bad children? Okay, now our most important question of all again. If we've been naughty, how do we protect ourselves against Krampus? Okay, thank you guys for talking to me. I'll talk to you later. Goodbye. Okay guys, so I know that seemed a little strange, but I want to know about Krampus and 
Want to know, like I said, if you guys have been naughty, how you can protect yourself from Krampus this holiday season. Uh, so hopefully we got some good answers there. I won't know until I go through this, but if there's anything that I do miss and my specialist miss, leave it in the comments below. Let me know uh, if you've been naughty or nice and if you're worried about Krampus coming this year in the comments below. Love you guys. Make sure to like this video and subscribe and please share this around. We are growing so fast and I'm so proud of you guys for subscribing and sharing. You're doing awesome. Keep up the great work. But make sure to hit that like button and share this with your friends and I love y'all. I uh, hope you have a great holiday season and hope you stay protected from the Krampus. Talk to you soon. Bye.